I have plenty of thoughts coming my way. And I just was reminded of something else. I, they will try to get martial law so that they don't have to do background checks. It's what they're going to do with the mass shootings. Simply because they don't want the background checks. If they get martial law, is what I'm telling you is, if they get martial law in place, they won't have to do background checks. And then the problem will be they will shut down the government and they won't have any way of getting Trump out of office. And it could cause a nuclear war. Yeah, take it like you want. Because that's what could happen. Uh, the thing is, if we let them start martial law, we will lose all rights as United States citizens, legally. We will have no rights at all. And people, another thing. You cannot let them start martial law. And you cannot let them take away our rights. They start martial law, they'll close down the government, and then the rich won't have to pay taxes. The poor will stay poor, and the wealthy will get wealthier, and the poor will die at the hands of the wealthy. And then what will happen is slavery, which is slavery. That's the same as slavery. And the thing is, technology will take over after everybody's gone. We are looking at the extinction of the earth if it's allowed to happen. And if I were you, I would start fighting for my country while you still have her. Trump said we should leave if we don't like the country. Well, you know what, honey? This is our country. We can't leave something we're a part of and we're already in because we belong here and nobody should ever tell anybody to leave their own country when they're a part of that country sorry that's the wrong thing to say as citizens of the United States no citizen should ever tell any other citizen that not even the president. He had no right saying that as far as I'm concerned. Because if we want to make our country a better place to live, we need to have people in this country that's going to make it a better place to live. And we need to take Trump out of office because he does not respect our country. He does not respect our people. And we need to look at his background. And you'll find plenty in his background in the business in which he works out of in New York City. I'm almost positive. And maybe, just maybe, we need to start doing a background check on all the presidents of the United States every time they're elected. Because this is our country. Not theirs. Ours. Everybody's. And everybody has a right to know who is governing their country? That's what I'm saying. And that's food for thought. You really need to do something, people. You need to stop relying on the computer. And you need to get out there and say something and do something. And get this country back. Take care and God bless. Bye now.